While we do see Mei grab the lantern and, and stare lovingly into the flame, we only see her light Osha's journal on fire. The camera cuts back to Osha, and then a few moments later, you can hear the lantern crash. So did Mei actually do it on purpose? Was it an accident after she realized what she was doing? Or hear me out. What if Saul was still spying on the twins, or he was sent to grab them when the Jedi undoubtedly showed up at the Citadel that evening under the guise of helping? How did Saul know May started the fire unless he was there? Maybe he even tried to stop her, and that is what led to her dropping the lantern. There's no way that fire took out all the witches either, and its spreading to their reactor seemed very suspicious as well, at least the speed in which it did so. And based on an earlier scene where Cordo hears something in the reactor room, one could speculate that a plan was already in the work to take out the witch coven before the night of the fire. So yes, the Jedi were involved in some capacity. It just comes down to did they willingly attack the witches after they learned they made babies using some form of dark magic? Or did someone or another faction set things in motion to frame the Jedi, split the sisters, and begin training Mei in the dark side of the Force? 